Hi Leo, getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is going on for you. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus are telling me to go to this guy for you. Okay. Truth. And you guys got knowledge. Something's coming out. You got two cards of truth and knowledge. So this could be finding something out, hearing something. Somebody's going to obviously tell you something. Okay, Raven Spirit and Air Spirit. Could be a message. Could be somebody at your work. Could be, you know, boss, whatever. Love. What is going on for... Let's see. Could be good news, too. So don't think that it has to be bad news. And the hidden position is a ton of coins. And the Page of Swords. There it is. That's the message. Page of Swords. There's a Page of Cups also under the deck. So... You could be getting some good news. Page of Cups, listen to your intuition. This could be about anything. Whatever you're working on right now or dealing with, I mean, it could be, you know, financial or love in nature or whatever else. Let's see. Let's go back through here. Two of Cups, Seven of Cups, Three of Coins. Oh, we got two here. Also, what's coming in as an offer or Four of Cups? and Knight of Coins. Okay, so <clears throat> definitely could be a person who wants to talk to you. Could be love, could be partnership. Two of Cups is here. Maybe somebody who is, I kind of feel like this is someone that you know who's coming in just to talk to you, whether it's text message, Three of Cups, Three of Coins. You seem happy. It might be an earth sign. I noticed under the deck, the Seven of Swords is under here. It's in reverse. It could be a Taurus or Pisces. Someone's going to reveal something to you or you're going to find something out. You could find something out like online also. You could see something. Seven of Swords, a secret or message comes out. And again, it's maybe something about the past or something. Nine of Coins, you're looking back. Something is working out in your favor or you're looking back and thinking something is wasn't as bad as you thought or it's changed. or it's, it's, This is good news. When I first pulled the cards of truth and knowledge, I wasn't sure. Like, it felt kind of like maybe... You might find something out you don't like. It's not. It's good news. It might have something to do with a water sign also because there's a lot of cups here I'm noticing. Some of you may, may get a like role if you're an actor or like something like that. You may get chosen. Especially if like, there's a group of people, you may get chosen. Uh, there could also be maybe a partnership here. So I guess I'm not take it easy. Don't worry. I, they're just kind of saying something like that to me. Like, but someone may be wanting to travel to see you, or maybe you might do some traveling. Okay, I do get something about a home for someone. Maybe you get that loan, or you get that home if you have a bid on a home. But okay, let's go a little bit deeper because what's going on. What is your message? Happy, happy. So I'm telling you, whatever this news is for you, this is good news. This makes you very happy. So this could be work-related. Okay. Yeah, I feel like some of you might be worried. Maybe you're worried about a relationship or worried about an, a job or something. But you don't need to be. That's the Seven of Cups. You have the Tower and then the Knight of Cups. See, something opening up. Could be someone has feelings for you and they, they reveal them or something like that or uh, they come towards you. Could be maybe a Scorpio for a few of you. I'll go to a different deck to see really quick here. And actually, you know what? Let me go to the love. What is going on for you? Okay, you deserve love and a past life relationship. So it could be somebody coming back from the past. Okay. I'm getting a name like Jimmy or Joey or Jamie or something like that. Could be significant. Okay, I think this is love for most of you, but so I am going to go to this deck and see what is somebody feeling. It feels like someone who's been away also may be coming back towards you. Like they've been gone, they've been traveling or something like that. But you have unexpected. So surprise, shocking, unusual, unpredictable. And spiritual awakening, enlightenment, epiphany, life lessons. See, there's some sort of like news, and I want it to be more specific because I can tell here that you're surprised by this, but it's good. Someone's waking up. Ace of Wands. Something that excites you, something passionate. 
judgment. So something could be coming back, back around, but then the fool. Something you've been hoping for. I also get the feeling of like it wasn't a, it wasn't wasted time or it wasn't a waste. Does that make sense to you? Because I'm kind of getting like something in the past may have felt like it was a waste, but now you're gonna realize it wasn't. Something is working out in your favor. If this is love, this is definitely somebody coming in with feelings or revealing something long term that they want with you. Four of Cups, the Page of Pentacles, could be an Earth sign, the Nine of Pentacles. Whatever this is, I feel like your money's gonna be good. So, I mean, this can be. I get also for someone, this could be like a job you were hoping to get, but you didn't get it initially, but now you are. This may involve either moving or like a commute. You may have to commute there. This also feels like for somebody, if you live in a high-rise building, like whether it's apartments or condos or whatever, um, somebody likes you or someone, you might meet somebody like while you're on the elevator and just really hit it off. So again, I get like work you did in the past is paying off now. So don't feel like it was a waste. Mm. I get somebody viewing also like being famous or being in the spotlight in the future. Someone also might be like an actor or act actress is what I'm getting, but... I keep seeing like an elevator. Someone has to go up and down an elevator. I feel like you also may meet someone while in an elevator or, you know, if you take the stairs or something. Very specific, but there could be a person who you're meeting. Someone may just ask you out. Like someone who lives around you or somebody you're building at work or if you don't work, someone who is like if you're just kind of out doing errands or something. I just kind of feel like you could hit, hit it off also. So be kind of open to that. Yeah, but I'm kind of getting a surprise that makes you happy. Awakening. Definitely looks like love. So it could be a Scorpio or Gemini Pisces for some of you. Uh, someone could be texting you again. Maybe you guys lost contact and you guys stopped talking for whatever reason. Uh, maybe they were dating somebody else. I don't see them dating that person anymore. Uh, also, they may tell you like how they feel with the truth card. They may just kind of say like how you know, they like you or yeah, revealing. So they're revealing something. It says opening up to you, tearing down walls. I guess that could be the tower and shows their true self. So someone could start being more open and open and revealing because Page of Cups, Ace of Swords is under the deck, Ace of Cups. So someone could be revealing their true feelings about you, that they really like you, they're attracted to you, something like that. Somebody for some reason wanted didn't want to move this forward with someone because they thought it was going to end badly. Someone had like negative thinking. They thought like the two of you, it just wouldn't work, so they ran. But I get like that person's coming back to try again or just, and they'll tell you like, they were afraid it was gonna be like a train wreck, so they just didn't want to take a chance. But so I could also tell you, I don't see runner energy in this reading or I don't see fear of commitment either. I don't see anything like that. So I think the truth is going to be something that makes you like happy. Like, okay, they had to go, you know, take care of some business or they had to go do something. But I do see a lot of passion here with this person. Is somebody, there's the, there's the full energy, the queen of cups in reverse and the six of coins. I get like there was an ex or maybe another person. Someone's not giving to that connection anymore. That situation is over. So there could have been like another person, but that person was very um, needy. Queen of Cups in reverse can be like very needy, overbearing, overwhelming, um, either too emotional or non-emotional at all. So that could also be a problem. The sun, so they're not giving to that anymore. The sun, they're happy, maybe a Leo energy. All right. I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a great week.